For 95 years, Marino School has been blessing students and staff members and even alumni. Here to tell us about her involvement with Marino School and why it means so special to her, we bring in our friend Mailani. Hi sis, how are you doing? I'm doing very well, thank you for Good having me. Good to see you. Good to see you. So, from Marino School, elementary, and now you're back here in 2022, what does that feel like to you? It's very nostalgic, it's very warm. I'm so happy, excited, and very thankful to be here. And now we're here, it's 2022, but you also gifted Marino something today. Tell us about that. So this mele is known as Pu'umalia, and actually a lot of, it was a collaboration of a lot of people put together, and I am the Leo, I'm just the driver of this mele. We really wanted to create more traditions for Marino, and especially Hawaiian traditions. We're here, a part of Hawaii, and the Catholic schools, the Catholic church has very rich history throughout Hawaii. And so I just thought that this was something that had to happen, and I'm very grateful that the school allowed for this mele to be a part of the school and its traditions and and of course a part of this 95th celebration I have the honor to talk to Stella and Rob of Catholic Charities Hawaii. How are you guys doing? Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. We're very excited. I was going to say, it is an exciting day. You know, we're celebrating 95 years of Marino. Um, Rob, I want to start off with you. What does it mean to you, Catholic Charities Hawaii, to be a part of this special day? Sure. Well, we have the roots in common of the Marino sisters. And when they came here about 100 years ago and established the school, and then a few, few years later, they established Catholic Charities, we're just really excited to have that root those roots in common and, and our values it's just really a special meaning for us I agree you know we've been covering uh, Marino school for quite some time now Stella I want to bring you into the conversation is there anything that you would like to say to the faculty staff students and families of Marino as an alumni I say go Spartans and carry on for another five years um, was a proud tradition and I'm so happy and proud to be a, an alumnus of Marino. I love that you're an alumni. Um, I want to know what is something that Marino instilled in you that you brought into the real world? Well it's also to give back and uh, provide service to the community and that's why I work at Catholic Charities. Everyone, I want to introduce you to Dr. Llewellyn Young, um, not just because his shirt looks amazing, but you are the superintendent of Hawaii Catholic Schools. I want to know a little bit about the significance of Hawaii Catholic Schools and this milestone for Marino. Okay, well, Hawaii Catholic Schools is a diocesan office that exists to support all of our Catholic schools throughout the entire state. So whether they're parochial, which means that they're right under the diocese, or they're private, which means that they're sponsored by a separate community, we service them all. And we give them a lot of guidance, a lot of support. We run their accreditation. We run their professional development. We do a lot of things to help them not just succeed, but to thrive in this economy and this new normal that we're experiencing around the world. What is something that um, makes you so proud of Marino School? Oh my gosh, 95 years is an incredible legacy. And so what I'm most proud of is looking at the alumni and looking at the next generation as they come up. I mean, we have some pretty impressive alumni coming from Marino. They're out in the community, they're serving their communities, and they're giving back to their school, which is what we want, which is what we hope for for Marino as they, they continue to thrive. We want them to continue to 95 more, right? Yeah. <laughs> to make sure that, that this legacy, this Catholic school legacy, right here in metropolitan Oahu, continues to thrive and can serve all the community members that want a good quality Catholic education. This is where it's at. Baranol is a, is a beacon of faith, of good quality education, and, and it's exactly what we want for our, for, for our community members here and all of our keiki. Everybody, I want to introduce you to Shauna Tong. Uh, she is the president and CEO here of Marino School. Shauna, congratulations. Thank what an exciting you. day. Thank you so much. So excited. 95 years of a great legacy, a great school. I want to talk a little bit about the legacy. Um, what does that look like to Marino School? Well, in 1927, established by the Marinolers, in particular the Marino Sisters, um, such a rich legacy in the spirit of noblesse oblige, giving back to whom much is given, much is expected. Shauna, you've been a part of Marino School since you were kindergarten. That's amazing. And now you're president and CEO. I want to know, what is it about Marino School that one, you're most proud of, and two, that keeps you here? 
You know, it's our deep faith, um, how we treat each other, that every member of the Merino community is welcomed, appreciated, and loved, and that we just create good human beings, good individuals. Anything you would like to say to the faculty, staff, and uh, families of Merino School? Thank you. You know, without the faculty, staff, parents, alumni, supporters, and especially our students, we wouldn't be who we are. Um, what a great legacy. Um, and also an opportunity to show others who we are, especially in this 95th anniversary. Shauna, thank you so much for allowing us into Marinol School. What an honor. What a blessing. Happy 95 years. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you.